Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh. And today we are going to do an important topic, right? This question, a question from this topic was asked in the 2022 exam. So that is why this topic is actually very important. So about inventory uh, costing, right? In all the books, there are three methods. Most of the books, FIFO, LIFO and weighted average. And even if a teacher is teaching you, he might be teaching you these three methods. But in the exam, question was asked from simple average method. And this method is not there uh, in most of the books, right? So that's what we are going to do today. We are going to do, we are going to start with the FIFO method. What is FIFO? FIFO stands for first in, first out. First in, first out let's uh, say you buy lollipops lollipops you you own a store aapka ek store hai and you buy lollipops you bought 1200 lollipops at the rate of one dollar each 1200 lollipops at the rate of one dollar each so the value of lollipops 1200 dollars then after few days the price of lollipops shoot up by 20 percent now it is 1.2 120 each so 500 lollipops the cost is 600 dollars so total cost of 1700 lollipops is 1800 now and you sold 700 lollipops at the rate of two dollars that is not relevant okay so you sold 700 lollipops so how many lollipops you have at the end of the day 1700 minus 700 you have 1000 lollipops in your stock that is your closing stock what should be the value of this stock in the books? Books mein kya value hogi is stock ki. That's what you need to calculate. So as per FIFO, what comes first, that is, uh, you know, that is consumed first. Okay. What comes first, the first inventories are, are the first ones to be sold and the inventories bought later are sold later. In case of bread, right the regular bread that we eat i mean this principle is used okay so the first 700 lollipops that we have sold their cost is one dollar their cost is one dollar right so the remaining lollipops the thousand lollipops in these thousand lollipops 500 lollipops the cost of 500 lollipops is one dollar and for the remaining 500, uh, 500 lollipops, the cost is 120. Okay. So the total cost, the value of closing stock is $1,100 as per the FIFO method. As per the FIFO method. Okay. The next method is LIFO method. Students, LIFO method is used in USA, commonly used in USA, and it is not generally used anywhere around the world except USA. LIFO means last in, first out. Last in, first out. This method assumes that last inventories bought are the first one to be sold. And inventories bought first are the last one to be sold. Okay. So you bought 1200 lollipops at $1. So 1200 dollar is the value of 1200 lollipops. And then you bought 500 lollipops at the rate of 120. So the value is 600. Okay. So 1700 lollipops you have and the cost is 1800 and you sold 700 lollipops. You sold it. So you are left with how much? 1000 lollipops. You are left with 1000 lollipops as per this method. Uh, the lollipops that you purchase later on, this one is consumed. This one is consumed first. This one is consumed first and then you consumed 500 lollipops from uh, the 1st July. Okay, so 700, uh, the 1000 lollipops that we are left with, the 1000 lollipops that we are left with, they are the one from 1st July. Okay, jo baad mein kharida, wo sara consume kar diya. we bought 500 lollipops on 13th of July, we consumed it and then we consumed the total 700. So we first we consumed these 500 and then we consumed the 200 from 1st July order. Okay. So 1000 is left here and the 
cost of this 1000 lollipop is 1000 only okay that is the value so lifo method is not generally used in india it is used in usa the weighted average co uh, cost method so uh, this method assumes that we sell all our inventory simultaneously uh, that means uh, inventory that we bought in the beginning or in the middle of the year we are selling it at once so lollipops purchased on 1st july at uh, at the rate one dollar and the lollipops purchased on 13th of july at the rate 120 okay we got it 1700 lollipops at uh, the total value is 1800 we need to find out the weighted average so to calculate the weight just uh, multiply it uh, you'll find the weighted average 1800 divided by 1700 is the weight so the value is a dollar and six cents that is the weighted average and if you consumed 700 uh, lollipops 1000 lollipops are left and the value is 1000 multiplied by 1.06 so 1060 is the value of closing stock the question that was asked in the exam is from the simple average method not commonly used very vague but still it was asked uh, let's say on the first time uh, you bought 100 unit at rupees 4 second time you bought 200 unit at rupees 3 at third time you bought uh, three, uh, 150 units at the rate of uh, rupees 2 so the average is a simple average is how much it's simple it's 3 rupee so this is your uh, average cost of the closing stock so let's say if there is there are 200 units in the stock the value is 600 very simple this is the easiest method not very practical right uh but still it was asked in the exam and now get back to the question calculate the value of closing stock using the simple average method so the purchase price is rupees 20 and the sales price uh, and the purchase price uh in the second order is 22 pehla order kiya 100 unit 20 rupee per unit dusra order kiya 200 unit 22 rupee per unit so 20 plus 22 divided by 2 simple i mean you can easily find it out 21 rupees is the average average price so average price is 21 rupee so so 21 is the average cost right so 250 units have been issued you purchase 300 units and 250 units have been already issued so the stock is 50 units 50 units is the closing stock how much is the closing stock 50 units is a closing stock so 21 multiplied by 50 21 multiplied by 50 1050 that is your correct answer that is your correct answer okay very simple question asked in the exam uh, i hope you like the session today and uh, we are doing the full fledged sebi grade 2023 course it's available on bankexamstudy.com we are providing the complete video classes notes test series quizzes full length test series is also there so descriptive paper evaluation is part of the course in case of any doubt you can drop a whatsapp message 9067201000 this is a whatsapp number ask your doubts anytime and we are going to answer your doubts right so list of our successful students uh, all these students that took our courses in 2021 and they cracked their respective exams i'm really really happy for them in 2018 all these students that took our courses and they cracked their respective exams i'm really really happy for them in case of any doubt just ask your uh, question on the whatsapp and i'm going to answer all your doubts and that's actually all for today students thank you and have a very nice day subscribe our channel on youtube like this video share this video with your friends and that's all for today students thank you and have a very nice day bye bye